Please. Ah. 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 All right, guys. It's Ken here with Tags Canine. I'm working with the Freya. Um, she is a husky puppy. Um, I guess they're about six, seven months old. She just came in for a board and train. It was dropped off earlier today by the uh, owners. And we are currently working with her. Um, this is just kind of our first session. We're going to introduce. Uh, some food, just kind of gauge how, how her food drive is and, and start teaching her about different um, placements, uh, getting her used to being up on elevated platforms. She'll want to jump off, so she's going to, you know, stumble a little bit and correct herself. Ah. So we just gave her a correction. Now I'm going to ask her to sit again. Yeah, good girl. And I've just got around about a 10, uh, 10 foot long line drag leash and a simple rope collar, no, nothing fancy. But all I'm gonna do is here is just try and develop a rapport with her and teach her the pressure at, of the tool. Let her know that when she's away from me that she's gonna feel a little tug. And then we'll slowly reward her every time she comes to us. I'll teach her, you know, get a little something something might not always be food early on we like to use a lot of food but shortly we won't have to and i'll go Freya, come come on. whoa yeah and then of course you guys always know that i'm all about quality not quantity so it's not giving her a bunch of treats free a place yeah good girl so yeah, I think she's going to be a lot of fun to work with. Um, uh, we're going to be working on some crate training skills, some leash walking skills, some treadmill skills, some socialization to really just help her be a well-balanced puppy. But um, she seems to be a really wonderful sweetheart. And, uh, you know, when I start off a young puppy like this, just take your time, guys. It's not about giving her a bunch of love. Um, but in the same breath, it's when I'm asking her to follow me, uh, or comply in any sort of leadership request. I want her to understand that she doesn't have to do it because I'm putting fear into her, but that it's more uh, enthusiastic and willing. So in this case, come. Yes, good job. Place. Yeah, good job. Uh, sit. Thank you. Yes, and I'm just going over some of our basic hand skills, letting her just kind of absorb everything. Um, once the dog can kind of understand, uh, is it gonna help me or hurt me? And kind of comes to terms with that. If it's something that she thinks it's gonna hurt her and she has some fear, then we confidently walk her through those, those, uh, those areas and that's where we really focus our training on. But some of the stuff like down, good down, I'll just reward because she did it. I didn't ask her to do it, but she did it. But I off is off as far as I'm concerned. So a nice elevated surface tends to help uh, help uh, get that point across. And then if I want to ask her to come and recall, are you come? Yes, good job. Good job. Place. Place. So all we do is we make a, sending, a center point, kind of a place where, where all good things come from. So the place caught is a place where she knows that she's typically gonna get some kind of love and some affection. And then um, from there, we just kind of try different areas. So yeah, she's coming along really well. Um, I'm really looking forward, it's gonna be some fun. So expect to have some really cool videos come out. Hey guys, if you have any questions, problems, uh, feel free to give us a call uh, or look us up online, tagscanine.com. 
www.tagstaggscanine.com. All right, guys, I appreciate it. Come on, kid. Let's go. That's a good girl. Oh, that's a good girl. Look at you. Uh, good job. Good place. Oh, that's good. Come. Yes, come. Come. Yes. Oh, boy, yeah, you're going to be fun. All right, guys, thanks. Yes, good girl. That's such a good girl, huh?